What is up guys, my name is Chase and welcome back to another unboxing video. So on my last unboxing video, we unboxed the PlayStation 4, which I got as a present for Christmas 2018. And with the PlayStation 4 for Christmas, I was also lucky enough to get the PlayStation VR. So this is going to be a little unboxing of the PlayStation VR. Once again, I'm so incredibly excited and grateful to get these awesome presents for Christmas. The bundle that my mom got me comes with Borderlands 2 VR and Beat Saber, along Along with two PlayStation Move controllers, which is really great to be honest. Anywho, I was going into the box here. Once again, just like the PlayStation, we have boxes within boxes. Here I am struggling to get the boxes out. <laughs> so let's save the big box for last and open up this little box. Right at the top here we have our code for Beat Saber. We also have a little PlayStation VR demo disc. This is the Demo Disc 2.0, which like, I didn't even know there was a Demo Disc 1.0, but it comes with all of these games here. I'm excited to try Job Simulator. And finally, we have our code for Borderlands 2 VR. And then on the side here, we have our Move controllers. And then here I am checking if there's anything else in the box, like an idiot. So here are the PlayStation Move controllers. I actually had the PlayStation Move for the PS3, but I'm not too sure what the differences are between the PS4 Move controllers and the PS3 Move controllers. In any case, let's move on to this big box. Right at the top here we have like a big PSVR instruction guide. It shows everything that comes in the box, which is pretty much a spoiler for this unboxing. Anyway, if we open it up here, it's like an explosion of cables and all kinds of stuff. We got paperwork. Here's the new motto of the processing unit. Um, to be honest, I wasn't a big fan of the old motto of the processing unit, so I'm glad they changed it. It's a lot more sleeker and, you know, it doesn't, like, move all over the place or anything. Uh, it's just one solid piece, and I like that. It's got a fan, a bunch of ports, ports on the back, ports on the front, all kinds of ports. Next up here, we have some earbuds. And I'm gonna be real with you here, like, I've been using these earbuds for a couple days now, and they're really not bad. I was honestly surprised. And, you know, they're designed to fit around the VR headset, which is nice. So they're not bad, honestly. We also got a power adapter, it looks like. Here's an HDMI cable, which is included, and that's cool. We have a micro USB cable. Here's the actual PlayStation camera, which I've honestly never even seen this new model. I know they had an old model that was basically a rectangle, but now it's more of a cylinder, which is cool. <laughs> Here's the stand for the camera. And then finally, here is the thing itself, the VR headset. Here's where I thought the cables were separate, but that's actually the cable from the VR headset. So we take off this packaging, which I'm sure is terrible for the environment and I feel awful about. Anyway, here's the actual headset. And as you can probably guess, this is like the newer design of the PlayStation VR headset, which from what I understand is just kind of minor revisions. The buttons are moved around and stuff. Not anything too major, but I don't know. It's cool. <laughs> Anyway guys, I mean that pretty much wraps up everything that there is in the PlayStation VR box. Thank you for watching this quick little unboxing of the PlayStation VR bundle which includes two PlayStation Move controllers, the PlayStation camera, and Borderlands 2 VR as well as Beat Saber. My name is Chase and I will see you again soon. Bye.